Hi, I'm Dr. Rose. I'm founder and medical director at Rose Dermatology. Today, we're gonna to be talking a little bit about dermatologic medications and about your visit to the dermatologist. It is very important to seek the advice of a board certified dermatologist. I have had patients come in, they had never seen a dermatologist before, and they were inappropriately using topical medications that were given to them from other specialists. Unfortunately, this can actually lead to more harm than good. So it's very important to see a board certified dermatologist to take care of your skin. I also recommend bringing all your products in to your visit with the dermatologist. That way we can review all the products. We can see how appropriate they are for your skin type. Sometimes your regimen can be making your skin worse. So it's really important and I think this is a very useful thing to do for the germ visit. It turns out these topical medications used in dermatology are a lot like condoms. They do not help you unless you put them on. It's not gonna help you if it's in your bag. It's not gonna help you if you never pick it up from the pharmacy. It's not gonna help you if it's over your mother's, boyfriend's, cousin's house. It's not gonna be of any use to you. You need to use it consistently and as directed. Facial skin is different than the skin on your palms and soles. It's different than the skin on your back. It's different than the skin on your torso. So oftentimes you, you need to tailor the treatment so that there's a different medication used in different areas. Most of the time, we send the patients out with a medication summary. In that medication summary, we review and we write down exactly how to use each medication and where each medication goes. The follow-up appointment is a very important appointment. At this appointment, I re-examine the areas that are being treated and I see what the response is. This is a really, really important appointment because from there, I can make a new plan to carry out in the future. Uh, we have to go through all the medications, see how the patient's responding, and change uh, the prescriptions depending on how the patient is doing. Some problems are gonna come and go, so you're gonna need to know what to do in those situations. Other problems are not likely to recur, so it's a one-time deal. Either way, the follow-up appointment is really important for us to go through everything, review everything, and make a plan for the future. 